kitchen. Y'all, we doing it up again today. Look, something quick and easy. We're gonna do a stir fry with shrimp and chicken sausage. You know, some andouille sausage. We're gonna hook this thing up. We got some, got my skillet already hot. Y'all know I already tried to cheat a little bit. Put some oil in that skillet. Cause the pan is hot. Cause you know, somebody always holler, shh, you gotta say shh, you gotta make that noise. If it ain't hot, you ain't cooking. I'm cooking, Doc, I'm cooking. So I got, this is my sauce. I have three tablespoons of minced garlic here. I'm gonna use a cup of honey, cause I'm making my own sauce up in this piece. I'm getting this ready, cause I have to have this sauce when I get ready to put everything else in the skillet. So I'm doing that first. Got three and a half tablespoons of soy sauce. That's low sodium soy sauce. We're gonna mix that up, get him ready. So once we get this meat going in the skillet, a matter of fact, I'm gonna go ahead while I'm stirring it and let this sausage. Whoa, look at that. Y'all hear that? Hi! All right. But you can use any kind of sausage you wanna use. If you don't wanna use chicken, you can use just an, any other andu so sausage. Um, we have a couple, actually I mixed a couple sausages here today, so I have that, but I, I have more andu chicken andouille sausage. It just, I think it's just gonna go better. It has a little bit more taste to me. It's not for those. So we're gonna let that start keep browning. I'm gonna stir, stir this up. I was gonna say stir him. So we have onion here that we, jula uh, how you say, julian? This is, this is the way you slice this up. We slice up the bell pepper. We cut up, but it's the proper thing. It's ju it's ju but I'm trying to say it right. I'm trying to help y'all. Help me. Help, you know. Like I said, I'm not a chef. I'm just a cook. How about that? So we have shredded carrots. We have mushrooms. We have zucchini here, broccoli. Then we have our topping. Then we have our jumbo shrimp. So we got this all going. This is a little garlic. I just want to add that, you know, me and garlic is it's my friend. But I'm really going to put more of that seasoning on the shrimp because it needs more seasoning. Oh, yeah. See, that's getting all nice and brown. So we're going to let them brown a little bit and then we're going to take them out and put them actually back in this bowl until we get the shrimp done. I'm using the same skillet. I'm using a large, a large skillet, guys, so you can actually try to hold all your veggies and all that together. Ooh, but that's, that's looking good right there. Cooking that down. I'm having fun in the kitchen. You can have fun in the kitchen. I'm gonna tell y'all, I really enjoy cooking. And thank y'all for all y'all comments. Thank y'all for watching Man TV. Hey, push that button. Subscribe, like and subscribe. Cause y'all know I'm doing this thing. We doing, you know, look good, smell good, taste good, all those good, all good, all the good. There you go, that's what we doing. That's what we're doing today. We're getting it ready for you. Woo! I get excited in this kitchen. I wish you could be here to join me. Maybe one day I'll have a live audience. I don't know. Yeah, if, you know, if this thing keeps growing, we, you know, we're going to do what we do. I'm going to that thing. So, I'm going to just let this other one brown just a little bit more. Oh, I lost one. I don't want to lose none of my... I caught it. Got him. All right. So that's good on that sausage, cause we're gonna add everything back. And I'm, you know, I'm right-handed, so I have to hold, I hold with the left. So I'm gonna put a little bit more oil. The skillet is still hot. Let it heat back up. We're gonna add our, and that's just extra virgin olive oil. Is what I'm using. That's all. So we have paprika right here that we're gonna add in here. We're gonna mix all that up on there. Put that in there. We have garlic. And you kind of season to taste, y'all. You know me, I want I want my stuff to have a, a good flavor to it. See if that's still hot. Because it don't take long for your shrimp to cook. Look at that. Woo! Y'all hear that? Oh, my. All right now. All right. Got that big jumbo shrimp. But you can use small shrimp if you have a large family. You can use medium size. I just put all the rest of that seasoning on there. I just gonna put probably just a little bit more garlic on there. Woo! 
Lord Jesus, this just looks so good. I need to add just a little bit more oil. And you go around the edge so you'd be able to spray it around evenly. You can cut, cause it'll kind of run down. But it's cause this, this actually, this is taking up, this shrimp is taking up a lot of oil. So you just kind of, kind of, kind of, you gotta watch it. You gotta watch, you gotta watch the shrimp. So we're gonna let them cook down. Then we're gonna flip them over because we want them to get nice and with a nice little golden on them. We don't want them to be tough. So you kind of cook them for a couple minutes on one side, then you turn it over. So while that's cooking down, I'm going to give me a fork. Remember, it's important to have you some good utensils up in this kitchen. Y'all hear that? Because I'm at home. Somebody's calling. So that's that's all that is right there if you hear that phone. But OK, so we're going to flip the, oh, man, that looks so good. But y'all know what? I can't even eat shrimp no more. So I'm fixing this for somebody else to enjoy. Boo. But, and sometimes that's what happens when, you, when you're cooking. So, but I can eat the chicken, but I can't eat the shrimp. So I'm turning this over, letting this brown on both sides. A few minutes, because I don't want my shrimp to be tough. So we can actually let that. The rest of y'all will eat it. Well, yeah. So y'all can, y'all can eat it. Because I can't eat it. They make me. I don't have like, I don't swell or anything, but it just won't stay on my stomach. That's what happens when I try to eat it. So we cooking that down, that's just getting nice and golden brown right there. So I'm gonna push this to the side. I'm gonna add a little bit more oil to this. So when I put my veggies in there, okay, so I'm gonna add onion. You don't have to do all that onion like me, but you know me, I like it. We'll add our broccoli, because we want to get nice and tender. All right, so I'm adding my, my, my veggies in there, but I just wanted this, this shrimp to cook just a couple more seconds, but I'm about to take it out and put it in the bowl while, while this is cooking. So I'm taking that out. So that look, how pretty that look? Look at that, woo! That looks nice. We don't want them to be overcooked. You don't want your shrimp to be overcooked. So I'm taking those out, pushing the rest of this this, shrimp, this um, broccoli and everything over. I'm taking that out of there. Actually y'all, this is really a really, really, really quick meal. Really quick meal. Why them so big shrimp? Man. All right, so we got that going. We'll add our bell pepper to it. Just a little bit more. Just so it look nice and pretty. We're gonna add our zucchini. Cause we want all this to cook down. And I love, I got a lot of veggies. Cause I really love it. I love veggies. I know a lot of people don't, but I do. I'm gonna add some more of this. I'm gonna add all this broccoli. There we go. We'll put a little bit, just a little bit of garlic on there. So, this, so they can have a nice seasoning to it. We're gonna add our mushrooms. I'm putting it all in here now, so what's happening is I'm gonna put just a little bit more oil on it, then I'm gonna put a top on it and let it cook down for just a few seconds. Cause the stir fry don't take long to cook. All right, I'm gonna stir that up. I'm gonna put that carrots in there now. I'm gonna add a little of this seasoning. This is the honey, soy sauce, and garlic. I'm just going halfway. You hear that sauce sizzling right there? Woo! Y'all getting excited? I am. And then I have a little chicken broth just to give it a little steam to it. That's about four tablespoons of chicken broth. But I just, I'm just trying to stir everything up so it can get really, the seasoning can get in there good. All right, and I still have more of my sauce that I made, but I just want to give everything a good stir. See my, it's starting to break down. See how your onions are starting to break down? It doesn't take long for your veggies to cook. I'm gonna go ahead and add these carrots. Since they so thin, I just don't want them to get so soggy. There we go. Woo! 
Lord have mercy Jesus. That looks so good. So we gonna put that in there. Then that cook down. We're gonna get a top. We got it on like a high heat. So everything can really kind of marinate and marry together. So we got that going. If you want it to look pretty, if you want to, you can add your little sesame seeds in there. Ooh. Look, get a little Asian in there. Woo! All right. That's cooking now, sis. Making that, taking that steam. I'm going to add just a little bit more of my sauce in here. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to add this on top. Put the sauce on this so it can start marrying together. So I can have seasoning in my in my in my meat. Put all that together. Ooh, we look at that. Man, y'all see that? Yes, we see it. We want to eat it. Y'all want to eat it? Yes. Okay. All right. So we're gonna let that simmer down. While that's simmering down, I'm gonna clean up and we're gonna come back. See you in a Tell us who you are and the title of the book. My name is Portia Mann and I am the author of A Healer's Journey to Healing. What do you want your readers to walk away with as they read through this book? Because when I started writing, I had only women in mind. Mm -hmm. But the more I started writing, the more I go back and read the book, it's for everybody. It's for anybody that is on a healing journey. If you are in a dark place and you feel like there's no hope, there's something in this book for you. We back! <laughs> Look at that. Boy, that... Oh my goodness. Look at that, y'all. Look at that. Mm -mm. I put that meat on top. We ready to plate this. You know, and actually, your veggies make a lot of juice. So you have to remember that, too. So sometimes you may have to drain a little bit off. But I'm gonna plate this. Look at that. So I got my. Ooh, ooh. Put that in there like that. Maybe I have a guess. You know, somebody I always stop. You know, you don't have a guess. You know, you already know people that are popping in. Woo! I mean, you did like the Matrix. You came. I didn't even see you coming. Where you want me to stand? Right here. Okay, you just you stand right. Let me make this. One. Let me finish this one, and then we can. I can't eat the shrimp, but I'm just gonna make it look pretty on the shrimp. I got this chicken. I can eat this uh and do the sausage. So we're gonna put a little onion on there to make that pretty. Yeah, cause it's small. Sesame seed on there. And you want a little pepper, a little crushed Why pepper? My mouth get water. A little crushed pepper for those who can take the spice, because some people can't take the spice. That's why they actually put it in it, because some people, you know, can't handle that being so hot. So I'm going to pull this off the fire so it won't keep cooking. So here we go, y'all. Look at this. You got chicken and shrimp stir fry. Look good. Smell good. Tastes good, all the good. All them goods right here. Look at that. You want okay, come on, you can taste it. Cause your mouth, I can taste it. My I mouth can... started watering like water like a mug. Come on, baby, I got you. That's hot. That's hot. Yeah, it's hot. You got your chicken sausage in there? Come you on. got the sweet, you got the spicy, you got the broccoli. Mm. You got your little kick with the pepper. You can actually add a little bit more. Crushed peppers on it. That's pretty good. Y'all, thank y'all so much. Thank you for hanging out with me and Mama Man's Kitchen. Remember, love more, judge less. Like, subscribe, check out, check out some other, excuse me, check out some other things on Man TV. We love y'all. Hey, keep watching. We got some more stuff coming. Send me some comments on what you want me to cook.
We got you. Love yeah, you. Yeah, but that a doozer, baby. Woo, look good. Smell good. Taste good. All the goods. Boy, that's good. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna say this plate. Maybe somebody else eat this. Mmm, mmm. That sausage is amazing. Yeah, there's a little bit of everything here. That's it, though. You get all your vegetables when you eat this. Let me get this. Oh, we gotta go. Okay, bye. Love you.